Do you ever get asked for your favorite color and not know what to answer? Well, in this week's Parsha, it seems like there is definitely a favorite color. The Torah says that on the corners of a garment that has four corners, you should have strings, tzitzit, and those strings should be usually white, but one of those strings has to be tchelet, p'til tchelet, has to be turquoise or light blue. And the question is, why turquoise? So Rashi, citing the Talmud, says, because the turquoise, the blue, the tchelet that you're going to have on the corner of your garments looks like the ocean. The ocean looks like the sky. The sky looks like the kiseha kavod, the heavenly abode. And that will remind you of God every time you look at your garments strings. Now, the question many wonder about is why go in such a long and roundabout way? Why go all the way from the Tchelet looking like the ocean, looking like the sky, looking like Kiseha Kavod? Why not just say the Tchelet, the blue that is on the corner of your garment is going to look like Kiseha Kavod or at least sky skip the ocean stage? What's the point of going in that gradual way? And the Baalei Musar, those who focus on the ethics of Judaism, explain the following beautiful explanation. Never ever think that you will radically change yourself overnight. If you want long and meaningful, lasting change, you always have to climb gradually. Don't jump and think you're going to skip any stages or cut any corners. Don't despair and think that, you know what, I'm not going to do this because it's too much. Always go in stages. The Talmud says, what does a wise person say? A wise person looks at the Torah and says, you know what, this is a vast amount of information that's very hard to master. But if I take a little bit every day, if I study just a little bit, one Mishnah, one Gemara every day, after a few years, I'll be very knowledgeable. But the opposite of a wise person, what does he say? He says, look, there is so much to be learned. There's so many books out there and so many topics I can cover that there's no way I will be a scholar and therefore they give up. The lesson of the tzitzit, the lesson of the turquoise, the blue, is that everything must come in stages. You must always look to accomplish one thing after the other. And just like the tzitzit, remind you first of the ocean, then of the skies, then of the divine abode, so too, when you're progressing in your personal growth, in your spirituality, always do it one step at a time. Don't despair on growth, but also don't jump too far at once. Shabbat shalom to everyone.